G'day guys, welcome back to Wombat Gaming. I'm going to be showing you a quick way to get Spino sales. This is my Spino run, and I'm going to tell you how I managed to get so many more. Uh, we just had a server update, so I've logged on straight away, and I'm doing the run straight away. As you can see, you're, I'm already getting, and this is the first run. I'll show you where on the map I am down here. Uh, basically, this run will start from here. Just follow me on the thing. So uh, we just got uh, this first one up. You can do this whatever way you want. Uh, obviously, the Rhino is probably the best way because he's fast and he can take these guys out. Let's see how many uh, Spino sales we can get. I mean, we're on a public server. This is the official server. So, um, we're going to head this way now, up the hill. There's another Spino pawn, spawn point over here. So, we've got one so far. And I always make sure that my Spino... Uh, sorry that the tail has been picked up too sometimes they do drop on the ground so it is worthwhile checking there it is there so we'll head on off um there are other ways you can do this uh look you can do it on an rg it's a bit if you don't have one of these guys it's a little bit harder i mean this guy takes the spino out pretty quickly and you can do it on on foot as well if you want to but you know running all over these mountains and uh, like maybe the barry he can follow the stream because that's pretty much where the Spinos will spawn. Anyway, this is the next spot here. There we go. There's our second one. Uh, and like I said, we're on official. Oh, he's nice size. <laughs> Look, we're hunting Spino cells. That's a really nice size one, but we don't really need it. So we're just going to take it out. It's a shame you can't breed these guys, to be honest. Um, like you can with other things to get you know, stuff for, for completing bosses. I've got a little bit of a server lag, what it sounds here, so let's try this again. Alright, we'll just, um, didn't see it get picked up, so I'm just going to double check that it is in here. guys uh, yep we did so all right we are off again so that's our second one now we're gonna head over the hill again so that we're heading over the hill you can see on the map there this is the way we're going uh, look there are lots of other people on this server a lot of people playing um, Scorched Earth at the moment so it is a few people less today so it does depend on how many people are on your server and we're going to head into this section down here. This is the next beginning of the Spino points. Now, the Spino tail is obviously essential for completing the Megapithecus boss, the ape. It's like one of the easiest ways to get lots of elements if you've got the right uh, rexes to do that one. And you need 10 sails. There's our next one up there. We'll just double check there's not one behind us. No, okay. So we've got another one up here. You can see level 75. Uh, we've got an alpha there, we've got to be careful of hit. Well, we don't have to be too careful, but... Alright, so he's uh, picked that one up as well. Um, yep, I'm just going to dump all this so I don't get too heavy. All right, and we're going to just continue down this river. You can do this on a server crash as well. So if you do have a server crash um, and it restarts, if you happen to be on when that happens, uh, do this run straight away. But definitely do it on uh, updates because, as you can see on updates, it just respawns all the spinos. This is another spot just here. Uh, it can be hidden a little bit in this section over here sometimes or to the right over here But he's not there at the moment. He's usually just in there if he is But we will check in this little section because I found him up the back sometimes Just here and it doesn't look like he's here today. So we'll just skip on back He doesn't go too further back than that especially on a server restart He might wander back there if something attacks him, but we're gonna head back down this river this way again 
Now there is a um, up further here. There is a shortcut if you want to head straight across the Red River. Look, someone looks like they're running around on a barrier already, maybe hunting spinos. So if there is any spinos down here, we may have missed it. But this river here, you usually find one after a reset. So um, not finding one means that the, that guy on the barry probably picked it up it was probably here somewhere or down in this little section down here so we've kind of missed that one that's why you got to be quick on this one people uh, really do look for these spinal tails now you can go across the map here it's straight into this redwood area over here but we're going to run through this river here um, because you often find spinos up here and a lot of people don't do this little section they do cut across red woods that river is seems to be the most popular spot so we're going to head up in through here and you can get random in these little sections here sometimes but i tend to find them a little bit further in so we're going to head this way and there we go so there's our next one see people don't tend to get up in here so we've got a level 20 and we're going to take him out I think we got the bag. I'm just gonna jump up here because I've attacked that guy. I just want to make sure that I got it. Yeah, yes we did. So we're gonna drop all this. And we're gonna head through this way again. So we're heading, I'll just show you on the map again. We're heading up this little trail of river and swamp area. And sometimes that's where we just killed that guy is probably the main one of the main areas and then just up here there's another sort of main area as well we do have someone built in this area but i have found they still spawn here so this is the other section and it's a bit hard sometimes to tell whether he's in there because you but i'm pretty sure he's not here he's sticking out. But this is the other section that you would find one sometimes and sometimes through here but this has uh, been built over so this small point's been uh, ruined by someone building over it, which is a shame. Um, so we're going to head through here. But anywhere through here, up in that corner there where that big building is, sometimes you'll find them there if there's no building there. But it is a popular spot on official servers for people to build. So now we're going to head through this little archway, back through to this, and then back down this river here. So we're just going to head through here. And sometimes you'll find one through here as well and around this sort of section um but nothing today so nope so then we're going to head down into this cavern and go back towards the red woods so we're going to head this way through, through here generally you won't i've never seen any through this little section but just as you come to the waterfall this is another good spot for spino spawns through here and nothing today now in this section up here too sometimes but someone has built all these walls around on this server this is probably another good spot but we're as you can see we are at the edge of the red woods here i'll show you on the map and we're going to head down the river along the red woods now and i'm just going to skip through here because that little section of the river doesn't have spinos now i haven't seen anybody else Oh, we did cut through that section just then but usually you might see another you know depending on how many people are on the server someone generally come across someone i always tend to run the uh the opposite side uh, so i go around and back through here whereas most people start on this side because it is uh, more popular all right so a lot of buildings in this section but this is another good spot for spinos normally too I'll show you on the map where we are. So just in this section here. All right, we're gonna skip over this little section here. And then our next section for finding the spinos is here. It's kind of these, these larger areas on this river of the Red Root. So. And usually about here is another spot for spinos. But I do follow this river all the way around now because they do tend to spawn up and down this little section a little bit. But as you can see, a lot of people are building on this uh, particular river at the moment on this official server. So it can 
ruin those spawn points sometimes. Uh, but this is we're getting into another popular area. You can see after a server reset, it just respawns every animal. Like it gets crazy. Like it's a really a good time if you're looking for dinos too. You want to like do a round. After I finish this, I will do a back run and I'll look for some of the things that I've been looking for. See if I can find some 150s and some things that I'm trying to breed. Or some colors, things like that. We are in an event at the moment. And then we got this large area here. Now, there are two things you could do here. If you you could quickly, and we will do it just for the sake of the video. You can go two ways here. Uh, just in this section in the red woods, this little section here, spino spawn there. Or you can go up towards the ice river up that way. We're going to quickly just zip up here and see if the midsection up here has a spino in it. Because I did find one here the other day, even though someone's built a little bit of stuff up here. So we will check. Got to watch out for the thylers. We'll go a bit higher. <laughs> All right, so one on a tree back there. Uh, all right, so this would be the other location, this little section here, but you can see nothing here today. They're usually just sitting straight in that water. I'm just going to check that thylar out. It was a bad color. Uh, if I can find it without getting knocked off, where did he go? I'll sit through here. Um, uh, he might have jumped already but it looks it was a thylar on a tree looking for nice colors of the thylers 150s but um can't see him he was just there in there somewhere but okay back to the the run all right so back to this section here and then we're going to head up towards you can see the blue obelisk there we're going to head through this section now you will find sometimes a spino in here um and the Ark Wiki does say through here you can find them. I've never seen one on dry land, but it does say they can spawn through here. So I'm going this way anyway, so I'm just going to sit through this section and have a look. I've got this little ravine and usually there's rexes and stuff down here. So there's a rex there, but generally don't find too many spinos. I've never seen one in that section. Lots of rexes though. It's a good spot for rexes. Right, we're going to go just down this way and we're going to start our next river run just here. This spot has been built over. I normally have good luck here, but this, I think they've just put a few too many things here. I'll just show you on the map where we are and where we're going to start our next run. We're going to start here and run up this river to the ice area and then round to kind of around here. And then we, um, yeah, we, then we can, uh, we'll finish the video, but you can do a rerun back. There's another Spino, so this is why I'm saying people don't come up into these ones. We've got a level 85. I'll take him out. There you go. When they get towards the end of their life, they'd like to do a runner. All right, I'm gonna just check. I didn't see it go up in my inventory. Oh, there it is there, good. All right, back to the river and I've kind of lost myself, where am I? Here we are. All right, so back to this river part and heading towards the kind of blue obelisk again. It's like a little waterfall. This is not a good spot up here for spinos, but this person has built over this spot, like fully over it. Um, it's taking quite a little while to reload after that update. But usually in here, you find a spino for sure. But as you can see, there's just way too much stuff happening in here now. So um, no spinos will spawn here again. Uh, it's pretty amazing this space when it does load it takes so long to load though there's a lot of colors someone spent a lot of time building this but unfortunately right on top of a spino spot all right so just this little waterfall here is our next start point for going through we usually you know you can find one just here and we'll just follow this river up towards the icy area here's the blue obelisk if you're looking for a reference it's it's pretty easy because you're just following these rivers 
I'm just going to keep an eye on my stamina. Oh, I'm getting a little low, so we might have to drop down in a second just to recoup that. Alright. And now this area where the this is where the ice cave is up into this section a lot of people are building in here but I've, I've definitely gotten uh, spinos in here so this is a good spot for spinos as well just don't just be careful you don't get trapped under the ice that can happen i've done that before i've gone down to kill a spino and got caught on that ice area you do not want to kill your a rhino that's for sure all right down in this way Another popular spot. Uh, sorry, my alarm was going off. I must have some eggs popping out in a second. So we're going to finish this off in a second anyway. So we're just going through this last little bit of river. This little bit here is also another good spot. I find spinos all the time through this last little bit. And that's pretty much it. I pretty much end the run there. So let's check how many spino uh, tails we did get. I'll show you on the map where we finished. I don't go any further than this uh, because we're, there are some spots. There's one spot over here that I know it's built over at the moment. And there are a couple of spots over this way as well. I will run back that way on my way out. But as far as the run goes, they take me way off, off the run. And that little run that I showed you uh, is like super handy. All right, so how many spine tails do we end up with? We ended up with five. So five is not a bad run uh, yesterday I did a run and I actually got 10 from that run so that was pretty cool uh, but um, I will do a rerun back through where I've just gone uh, you'll be finding that they will respawn if no one's hunting them as well so if this was helpful to you guys at all if you've got any questions for me just pop that in the chat hit that like button consider subscribing and we'll see you on the next video thanks again guys